Welcome along to ABA Peach Boxing, bringing you the sweet science. I'm Benji Tipa. I'll be joined very shortly by Isaac Savage here tonight. We've got um, Omid Azizi from Peach Boxing up against Cooper White from Nabby's Boxing. MC has just informed us they've fought each other 10 times and it's five wins each, so somewhat of a tiebreaker here. We are now ready for number 12 or number, yeah, number 12 of the night. Omid Azizi, Cooper White. I have seen Ahmed Azizi over the years. Next gen, next generation. He's one to watch. And like our boy tonight said, these boys have thrown down 10 times. Take nothing away from Cooper White. Also out of Nabby's boxing. Such a good gym. Bragging rights are on the line tonight. Nabby's boxing, Peach boxing. Omid there in the red. Cooper White there in the blue. Oh, here we go. Oh. It's easy. Yeah, very sharp, very crisp. Using those angles, but Cooper White also been a few rounds with this boy, so he knows what he's all about. He's going to fire back <laughs> both these boys. The, the pace, the velocity. See, what's interesting to see as well is, yes, they are amateurs, but the skill set and technique they use tonight at times is a little bit quicker than fast pacing the pros. <laughs> Just as I say that, both boys exchange a ten hit combo. Cooper White there, leading back, leaning with the left hook. Zizi coming forward, the aggressor. Zizi very aggressive. Cooper happy to uh, have the hands quite low, throw those counters, move away. He's got the reach advantage, so... And of course, Zizi trying to get inside. Interesting to see, too, that Cooper White, a bit of a counterfighter at this stage, stepping back and landing shots on the back foot, which is a beautiful skill to have, whereas Azizi is just a bit more of a walk-forward fighter, not showing the dynamic or cerebral vision that Cooper White has so far. See that he stepped left and then right, the, the dynamics here of, of Cooper is just a little bit quicker. His synapses in the brain of Cooper are, are, are just firing slightly quicker than Azizi. However, he might get caught. Faint there from Aziz or Azizi. Also stepped out of the way of that jab. 
So his timing started to come up a bit too. Nice right overhand there from Azizi. Good close first round. I'll let you call that one. <laughs> Tough one to call. I'm just enjoying the fight and I'm watching. I'm, lo I'm loving watching these two go at it. Azizi is definitely the aggressor. With Cooper White being a bit more of a counter puncher. Cooper up in my eyes in, that, in round one. But I usually just call it the first round and then let go from there because, as they say, the commentators cursed. We can say how it went one way and it ends up going the complete polar opposite. That's why I don't ever call them anymore. <laughs> I suggest, but I never actually call around. I've learned, I've been caught out too many times with the wrong call, so. It's almost like they do that just to uh, go the polar opposite way of what we said. So you're right, it's best to stay quiet and let the judges make that decision. And the MC announced it at the end. Round two. Cooper White there in the blue. Omid Azizi there in the red. Coming forward aggressive as hell. Just throwing down. Reckless regard. Where's the jabs? It's just coming forward. Even though Cooper White there is the counter puncher, Aziz, Aziz is uh, controlling the ring so far. Holding the middle Very differently. Quite a the two. Azizi still the aggressor of the two. Continue to walk forward, but get cracked now and then from the deflective and counter punch style there of Cooper White. Good thing to do with the counter puncher as well is get them in the corner. They can't move. Get them in the corner, especially the opposite corner, so they can't hear their cornerman shouts or commands. Azizi trying to do that at times, but Cooper White very evasive. Nice slip and rip to the body there. And then landing with the overhand is easy. Both boys thrown down. It's almost like it's the first round. They've still got gas for weeks as they throw bombs toward the end of round two. Wow, another close one. Moments ago as well, we had the announcement of Moze Amatangi and David the Great White Light fighting on the 11th of December on the Parker Far Undercard. And what a fight that's going to be. Hard one to call. Hard one to call, Benji. I'm just looking forward to the action going down that night. Yeah, same. Hard one to call, just like every fight I've ever commentated. <laughs> Yeah, and I'm not even going to try and judge this fight right now. First round, I would say, in the corner of the blue. But who knows, moving forward, what the judges are seeing. Because we're just seeing it from up here. Bit of a bird's eye view. They're seeing it from all angles. They're seeing the punches land from ways we can't up here. As we get ready now for round number three. The money round. As I say that, they are just throwing bombs. safe to say too that these amateurs tonight are throwing much more than the pros were. Yeah, very busy at all the amateur fights tonight, have been very busy. Just walking forward, taking those punches now. I'm loving the aggression here from Azizi, those body shots, goes low, goes high. 
just punishing the body now of Cooper White. Cooper White still moves away though, still being dynamic. But it is hard to escape the smothering pace here of Azizi. Azizi just forward, forward, forward the whole time. He keeps flicking his right foot up. Maybe he's got something wrong with his leg, I don't know. Cooper White looking a, a little bit worse for wear now. He's still taking the hits. Not as flash and light on his feet as he was in the first rounds. But how can you blame him when this monster like Azizi comes forward at you for three continuous rounds? I don't think he's taken as easy this is. I don't think he's taken more than a maybe five second break from throwing punches. Well, and he also forward. hasn't taken a step backwards. <laughs> I don't know if this guy knows what backwards means. He did then, but that was only because the ref separated them. <laughs> well, that could be the only time tonight. <laughs> I think that's the only time he's gone backwards, you're I right. I don't think he has any comprehension of the word backwards. On the ropes, and he's coming all. forward again. Slipping Beautiful punches. Duck and Beautiful. Weave. Nice fight. What a fight from both these warriors. I mean, Azizi there in the red. Cooper White in the blue. They fought many a times as we get ready now for the judge's decision. confusion here as we get it ready now for the judges decision we go to MC Lionel Husband Omid Azizi aggression takes it out in the end and he takes the win away from Cooper White who did take out that first round but Azizi takes it out in the end and what a performance yeah what a performance from both boys but that aggression got him through in the end see this young man come up the way he has always comes out of fight and he is certainly one to watch in the future as well Omid next generation Azizi 